We are here. We are here. We are here. On this amazing day. Everyone, this is Cam Jones at XLE Analysis. And we are marking up USD, JPY. Let's take a look at what's going on in the market as an overhaul. Price action highs. Price action lows. Midpoint in the middle. Go to price action, see where we located. So price action, last candle in the market. Inverted bullish hammer. So you can see the market working its way up to that high. Working its way up. And the last candle, same as the previous one, which is price action. What price did was tag that area twice. So it's coming, it could be coming down from that second time or pushing up from that second time. So, so far, market spiked up once, market spiked up twice in that area near price. We got the consolidation from midpoint. So the market broke, came back to retest, and now it's trying to break out. Headed down to the weekly time frame to see what's going on. Price action, excuse me, price action. Bearish hammer. Market trying to work its way down, but not too sure if it's going to do that yet. But what we see at the overall, market spike that resistance area a few times at an incline. Something like a tight wedge pattern trying to form. Breakout should be happening soon. Can be happening soon. First, so market spiked up once. So let's just follow the green coming up. So green coming up first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth. So market spiked up one, two, three, four, four times at that area of resistance, wasn't able to break. So if you think about it as price action highs, price action lows, midpoint, where's price action currently at? Break at the retest for the second time. So we're gonna see if a pattern is gonna be formed in this area that's gonna push this market up. So if that market pushes up, we'll be looking for that market to Identify that first, second, third, fourth leg for that W. It's coming down. It's coming down from that from that price area. It's coming down from a double top overall. Quadruple top. So first leg, second leg, third leg. Market pushes down for that fourth leg. Look for that break retest. Market works way down further. Headed down to the daily time frame to see what's going on. Price action candle, bearish candle, bearish hammer. Price is working its way down. We can see it's tagging some uh, area right here. So let's pull back, see what's going on. So look about price action. We have a double top, first leg, second leg, third leg. Market's coming from that double top. Is at a midpoint, price action low, down at this area here. So we still waiting for structure to form. We'll see what's going to go here. We do have bearish hammer. So our market's working its way down. Price action is above body, is below the previous body of that second last candle. And price is below the previous wick. Okay, so we can see that market's working its way down. We're gonna see if it's gonna run it to some type of support and bounce back up or break down, consolidate. Head down to the daily time frame. So far, it's still bearish, working its way down. On the four-hour time frame, price action, bearish hammer. So we can see that market's working its way down. Got a huge engulfment candle from the previous side for the previous one, two, three, four, five, six, nine candles. So when market just so price action basically just close up below this doji here. So we if we extend that doji out to the outside, 
market broke that SR line, if you think about it coming out of that doji. So we may be looking for a pick and retest as we walk down a time frame. So let's mark this up just a little bit better. So we're looking to see if we can identify a break and retest. We got the break. Let's see if we can identify a retest mark so if we could push it. Or maybe we could be at the break city on the three hour time frame. Price action. Bearish hammer working markets working his way down. We clearly see the break on the SR line and we did follow up from Doji headed down to a two hour time frame. Three, two hour, gonna find the same thing. One hour. We got a retest, so we may identify some type of retest in that market as we walk down further. Third to last candle is a Doji. Break retest market push down. Market could still push. Or we can still get some side-by-side -side consolidation for that market to return back. So you may want to see some green candles push back up, pressing red here, come on down. If it breaks down further, you'll see a break and retest of that overall break retest. Market's work is way down. If not, break second, third, fourth, market's work is way up. So let's head down a time frame to see what's going on. We're going to see if we can get some support here. Yeah, price as we walk down. Heading down to the 45. So we are, we're getting to a little bit of support. Side by side candles. So price is identifying on the 45 minute. Two pushes down to that bottom, which is a double bottom. Head down to the 30 minute, see what's going on. 45, 30, identifying the same thing. 15, still identifying a double bottom. You can see the offset from the second last candle. Second last candle from the third to last candle that closed out. The market did a nice big push, paid back the retest, and pushing down. So you may see if we can see if a break and retest in that area on the five or the three, and how we see on the three. So price action, second last candle, dojis. So that's market consolidating. So we're waiting for a breakout. Waiting for a breakout. This area of consolidation. Market just broke a midpoint, so market broke, came back to retest. We waiting for a pattern to form in this area for that market to push up, push down, or push sideways. Keep on walking down. Head down to three. Excuse me. We could clearly see the break and retest a lot clearer. A break and retest in that area here. Market push down, so some type of pattern is trying to be formed. First, second, third, market push up in that W. Or it could just break down from that break and retest and work its way down further. Or we may get a double top that's going to hit that, that tag that first, second, third, fourth, and market pushes down. And then we look for a retest, market push down further. Headed down to the one minute time frame. So it's identifying a break, retest, break, or back to support. So it's just sitting here. So it's, it's between price is at between the third leg and the fourth leg, push it, maybe going to push up or it's maybe going to push down. But whatever it's going to do, ask then go up the second last can do doji, close out to push that market up and down. Or multiple candles to identify that pattern or close out in a nice structure to push up or down. Hey guys, this is Cam Jones, FX Daily Analysis. Thank you for watching. Thank you for your attention. USD, JPY.